Hey guys, I've been asked the uh, difference with a blowtorch between porcelain and engineered stone. Let's do it. Alright guys, we got um, a lot of direct messages about engineered stone and porcelain, what the difference is. So we thought while well, we've got the blowtorch filled up, let's do a one-on-one -on -one comparison. Now what I'm going to do is I'll leave that there, let's count the 10, right? So we'll do a 10 second comparison. So we'll check on the probe. We've got to 400, 380, 400, let's climb, okay? So that's maybe 10 seconds. Yeah. What I'm going to do to compensate the thickness of the engineered stone, pull that back. We'll do the same with engineered stone. So it's a 10 second. There, we've got 256 degrees, but I can't hold it anymore. It's got an extremely hot. Turn this off. Okay. So the temperature here is I'm reading about 100 degrees, and that was smoking up before, and we can see how yeah, that's smoked up, and the splashback is perfectly fine in porcelain. So that's a comparison between porcelain and engineered stone. Thanks for watching.